Hello Libra, thank you for joining me. I uh, wanted to give you a sneaky peek at what October's got in store for you. So I've actually given all these decks a really good shuffle off camera to save time. But I did want to just shuffle a little bit on camera so you can see that I'm not just choosing cards I want to read. These actually do have meaning for you because I've spoken to the angels, spirit, ascended masters. I've asked them all to give me advice and guidance that will help you in October. So I'm ready to go. I might not use these cards. They're there to clarify if I, ne if I need it. So the overall energy we've got, simplify your life, eliminate clutter from your home and work life to balance the flow of activities. I couldn't read that last word. So simplify your life. That's what's going down for you in October. We've also got the Six of Cups. And the Six of Cups is about children. It's about, um, it can be about children. It can also be about reminiscing about the past. It can be somebody coming back from the past. I'm thinking, simplifying your life, whenever I do that, I end up looking through old photo albums and that would make me reminisce. But let's just see if that's the same for you. I'm not taking reversals. Um, I've already told the angels that, so they've come upside down. Okay, so what have we got? Wow. This Knight of Pentacles tells me that there's an offer coming in and the Knight of Pentacles rides the slowest horse in the deck. The Knights are really quite fast normally, but he takes his time and I like it because by the time he's got to you, he's really thought about the offer. So the Pentacle that he offers you is well thought out and it's usually very successful so just watch where an offer comes in for you in october i want you to simplify your life to have a clear head so that you see this because the ten of swords can be when you are too much in your head yeah the swords are about thoughts and emotions and uh, there can be messages and communications but the Ten of Swords represents a painful ending as well. Now, I like this deck because she's got over the ending. She's maybe not completely healed, but she's walked away from it. She's not dwelling on it. And so as she moves on into a new beginning, she is... I can see the new beginning with the simplifying of life, but I can also see you focusing on the past, you know, or... Definitely, I'm sorry, I've had a peep at the card underneath. It's the Hermit card. And so the Hermit card always goes within. He meditates and thinks and um, finds the answers within because he's very wise. Uh, he might even spend time alone. And then we've got the King of Pentacles. So I'm going to clarify the King of Pentacles because I want to know whether that's your way of thinking, your moving into this energy because you're moving on and you've taken this offer and it's very successful because the king of pentacles is a very successful card i hope it stays up um he's wealthy he's wise he's successful and i want to know if that's you or if somebody comes in to help you from your past so let's find out what's the king of pentacles all about please for libra in october while i'm shuffling happy birthday libra it's your month isn't it I should have said that at the beginning. I hope you've had a lovely birthday or you've got good plans. Ah, right. So we've got the strength card. And yes, options. So I think it's you. I think you switch up your mood. Whatever this offer is, whatever this, um, it could even be an idea, but it's usually somebody presenting an offer to you. Um, whatever this is, it makes you move on. And it makes you move on into such a way that you start to, with because you've simplified everything, you've remembered who you are, it's all about you. It's not necessarily a person coming in to help you. It's going back to who you really are, this gentle, loving, caring person. 
who um, can tame a beast. Yeah, this is you. Remember, you've got your link to spirit as well. And so you kind of get your head straight. Yes, it's been um, you've had a period of time where you felt confused. You've had lots of options and you felt like you're in the dark. But maybe this offer, maybe this information here brings the clarity you need. And that helps you to move forward into um, a very, very productive and successful end of the month yeah so it might start off feeling it should never feel like that in your birthday month let me let me say that um but realize you are moving on you are moving on from a tough time and you're moving into success really quite quickly yeah just keep balanced keep um patient and that clarity of mind that there that confusion it will lift when you simplify your life yeah so if you declutter and you actually clear your head this clears and that leaves you being who you are yeah this wonderfully balanced and patient kind person well i hope that's helped you have a fabulous birthday libra see you next time